Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be two looks in one for New Year's Eve. So I'm going to be using the Modern Renaissance palette, but then I'm just going to be adding liner and glitter to bring it to this look right here with a bold lip. So I think a bold lip always adds like extra drama and like bam. You know what I'm saying? So if you guys are interested in seeing how I created these two looks, then keep on watching. I also wanted to let you guys know that on my Instagram I posted five outfit ideas for New Year's Eve. So if you guys want to go check it out, then I will put the link right here. You guys can also click in the description box on the link that I will leave there as well. I would love for you guys to join me on my Instagram. I always post new things every day and stories a lot too. All right guys, so first we're gonna start off with foundation. I'm using this Kevin Aquan, the Etherealist foundation. This is in the color EF04. Okay, so now I'm going to be using Makeup Revolution Fast Base Concealer. This is in the color C4. And whatever is left over my eye, I'm going to put on my lid just to get it ready for eyeshadow. So I'm going to be using this Cover Effects. It's a bronzer color. I got this a really long time ago and I haven't used it, but this is the lighter shade. And this is what it looks like. Just honestly gonna dab it on this brush. And you're gonna wanna blend it and buff it upwards. You don't want it to go below this line. And you also don't wanna keep it sharp. We're also gonna add some on the forehead. Just taking my foundation brush and going to further blend this out just to make sure everything blends in seamlessly. And I have a large forehead, so this is why I put a good amount onto my forehead. If you have a smaller forehead, you don't need as much or none at all. For blush, I'm going to be using Benetint. I'm just going to keep continuing with liquids. Now I'm going to be using this Power Glow Highlighter by e.l.f. And this is in the color Rose Gold. I think it's such a beautiful um, highlighter. It's super like dewy. So I'm just going to use my finger. See how beautiful that is? It's so affordable. And this is so great if you have dry skin because it's not going to dry you out further. Okay, so for this eye look, we're going to be using the Modern Renaissance Palettes by Anastasia Beverly Hills. I'm going to start with Tempera as a base. We're going to go in with Bon Fresco as our transition shade. So we're starting in the outer part of our crease going inwards. And you always start in the outer part because that's where you want the most color concentrated. And then you go inwards to blend. I'm going to do the same thing to the lower lash line already. Now I'm going to take Venetian Red and I'm going to deepen up this crease. And you always want to use your first brush, the one with your transitional color, to help blend any harsh lines. You never want to lose that transition shade or your eyeshadow will look harsh. And that's not what we want. So next is this Inglot Pigment. This is in the color 23. It's a beautiful um, silver color. A lot of us don't wear cool tones on our eyes because we don't like them. But for New Year's, we're going to wear cool tones. 
So use whatever's left over in the lid first because you don't want to like, you know, have like intense fallout. And you want to make sure the two connect and blend. I'm also going to use this white one, 75, for the inner corner highlight. So next thing we're going to do is some winged eyeliner. And I'm going to be using Inglot's number 77. It's in here. I already depotted it. Just take any black eyeshadow and smoke out just a little bit on this outer corner to blend in that wing. For mascara, I'm using L'Oreal Voluminous, the burgundy one, one of my favorites and so great for green eyes. It really makes them pop nicely. Totally put on fake lashes as well. For lip, I'm going to be using Jordana Rock and Rose. This is one of my favorite lip liners and it's super cheap. It's like three or four dollars best thing ever. Now if you want a little bit more glam, here's part two. So I'm going to be using this NYX Vivid Brights Liner. This is in the color Vivid Fire. It's actually one of my favorite colors. Gotta love red. So what I'm gonna do here is outline this wing. It's gonna take a lot of precision, guys. Next thing we're gonna be using is just liquid sugar. This is just a glitter base, it's very liquidy. And then this is just glitter. It has stars with a silver wand. And this is from Glitties. I actually found this on Amazon and they have like the coolest glitters. So I just like bought them all. Take the glitter. And now for the lip color, I'm using a ColourPop Ultra Matte Lippy. This is in the color More Better. I love their formula, even though a lot of people hate it. I just love it. I wish you guys all the best in 2019. 2018 has been an amazing year for me. I haven't been on YouTube much, but I promise in 2019 I'm really going to do it because I really, really, really just want to share my knowledge with you guys on everything that I do with health, fitness, meal prepping, beauty, hair. I mean, you name it, I feel like I can do it. That sounds terrible. But you know what I mean. I feel like... Why not share the information I have if it could help somebody out there? So 2018 has been awesome. I've done a lot. I've grown a lot. Um, I've had help from many people, people who inspire me, people who love me. Um, there's been ups and downs. But I wouldn't change it for the world because it made me who I am. I really hope 2019 is an even better year for me and for you guys. I hope it's the best one yet. I wish you guys lots of health, happiness, success, everything you could ever imagine because anything is possible. So I will see you guys in 2019. Have a happy, healthy new year. Bye.